What's up guys? Tony Rican here and today I'm going to have a fun throwing down with a cool little dinner. I'm going to be making a one pot gnocchi pot pie. You know exactly what this is, don't you? That's right. This is awesome. So let's just go and get started and jump right into this one. Remember guys, if you love all the cool content I'm putting out in my channel, the easiest way to make sure it keeps on rolling and help the channel grow is you to hit like and share on this video. Drop a comment down below, then go ahead and subscribe and share my YouTube channel. That way, every Monday and Friday you'll get a brand new, really cool, simple recipe just like this one pot gnocchi pot pie. Which to start, I'm going to take a little bit of butter and start melting this down. While that melts down, I'm going to go ahead and dice up some celery, some carrots, some shallot, and mushroom. Once our butter's melted, I'm going to take everything, add it in the pot, and let it go for, let's say, about three or four minutes. After they started to soften a little bit, I'm going to add some salt and pepper and let it go for about another five minutes. I want them nice and tender. Next, I'm going to add in my garlic, some thyme, and some poultry seasoning. I'll mix it all together and let it go for about a minute or so. Let that garlic get nice and fragrant. Next, I'm going to sprinkle my flour over the top, get it all mixed together, and let that go for about a minute. After about a minute, I'm going to add in my chicken broth, get this mixed together, and add in my milk. Then I'm going to bring this to a boil. Once it's boiling, I'm going to add in my gnocchi, turn it down, and let it simmer for about five minutes. After that, we'll add our chicken in, then our peas, let it simmer for a couple more minutes, and this one is done. And that's it, guys. This cool little dinner is done. Just take a look at how it came out. It freaking looks awesome. My gnocchi's nice and tender, so are all my vegetables. And look at this, guys. Everything just looks great. But you know, I can't just look at it all. I gotta go ahead and dig in. Let me get a little bit of all there. And give it a try. Mmm. This is freaking amazing. This is going to be a great little comfort food your whole family's going to love. So go ahead, like, share, comment on the video down below. If you need complete step-by-step -step instructions, check out, head over to AverageGuyGourmet.com. Check out my Patreon. Consider subscribing for even one dollar to help this content keep rolling out. Give this one a try, and we'll see you guys next time.